Yeah. 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 Time to start yeah. We yeah. got the Calypso king of the world in the building. Chop this them. is 96 Ooh. number one. I'm going from party to party. Hey. I never meet nobody. Hey. I'm going from fat after fat. Hey. I never meet a speak station so yeah. Hey. I'm going from party to party. Say. I never meet nobody. Hey. No, 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 Take me home. Take me home. Hold me true. I wanna hold me true. Let, Let me show ya. <laughs> what I gonna do? Mad, 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 mad. This song was actually <laughs> released in Europe. Yeah, man. He did it that way because you just came back from a European tour, right? Yeah, the European tour went from May to June this year. Uh-huh. And, and I had this song actually since December last year. All right, so uh, so this European tour came yeah, about man. because of your success in the Calypso field? Definitely. Yeah, I was invited to um, Copenhagen Carnival. Primarily because there's a particular lady who comes to Carnival every year, but she is a Calypso fan. Right. She, she attends all the Calypso events, and because yeah. of the success of winning the Monarch back to back, and the fact that I also do soca music, she said, you would be the appropriate artist to bring to Copenhagen. Yeah. Sense, it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> Let me ask you something. Let me ask you, come on. You're, you're, how many years now have you been doing Calypso slash soca? Uh, nine years. Going on ten and years. You seem to have won and accomplished so much in a short space of time. Tell yeah, us man. how many things that you have, how many things you have won. Nice. It's just, no, no. <laughs> I wouldn't say a short space of time. No, he just start real early. <laughs> Think about it. No, but have, he but, start early. But, yeah, but I mean, who, who doing this <laughs> and... I understand the question. Yeah, yeah, but I guess yeah, 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 um, well, so far, in terms of major titles, mm. three major titles. The Independence Monarch in 2012, which commemorated 50 years of independence. Mm. Yes, I remember that, uh, yes. Last year, the Calypso Monarch, and then defending successfully this year. Uh, 2013 was a year I felt I could have done the... the tri- By now, I, sh- I think I should have had the tripeat, but time and place... Everything is so timing. Next year is a Yeah, but you seem to be very comfortable. <laughs> you seem to be very comfortable, you know. Yeah. Sometimes you see someone, um, you would see an artist and, you know, with all their accomplishments and mm-hmm. all their winnings and, and success or whatever you want to call it, they seem to be miserable and it's be like, yeah. Daddy, why are you getting on so? Why are you so? But you seem to be very comfortable. You're always smiling these yeah, days. Yeah, man, yeah, man. You're not pushing <laughs> nobody. No, yeah. no, we're not about our life, no. <laughs> nobody can say you seem to be taking um uh how I should say it um your success yes in stride in stride yeah because nicely. because it's freedom yeah that's it, that that is the answer Chuck, Freed, Chuck, I Chuck, feel, let me ask you mm-hmm. that again too why calypso you have, you have very rarely you see a young a person you you that young yeah I embrace cal not soca eh? calypso we have, we have time to talk we have time to talk fellas you well for me well for me well, for me well quite frankly I, I I don't really try to focus on the separation too much because okay. it's, because the separation is as a result of external issues carnival yeah. and the commercialization right because let me briefly say that the Calypsonian was the soca artist in the 70s and the 80s. Yeah. He was the same person in the parties, in the Calypso tents, singing his songs on the March Grand Night, yeah. which, were, which could, have, could have been considered party songs as well. Yeah. So for me, the separation is not the issue. Mm-hmm. My focus is on what it was and what it ought to be, not what is. Mm-hmm. My focus is on the balance. The, ba- the balance which I call in from now on, which is my album, the title album coming out very soon, right. called Jiggy Calypso. Okay. Which, which is really just a representation of what our art, what I think our art form ought to be. Mm-hmm. And just briefly, the categorization is this. Concept, theme, melody, music, danceability. You must have a storyline. You must tell, you must say something in the song. Yes. It must be danceable. And melodic must have that space to create that mood, that vibe within people to transport them from one place to the next. And that is what I think the artists in the 60s, 70s, and 80s did, which is why yes, Calyp- quite, which is what Calypso music represented. You wouldn't believe I yeah. just had that yeah. conversation with yeah. somebody today. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And, they were, and they were successful moreover than our artists currently. Yeah. And, you know... Is a model for me to follow, and it is so fitting that the foundation that I built for myself and mm. the foundation from which I come from has brought me to this place to be able to do this because, because I saw the manifestation of it in Europe in the response of people to this particular song. Yeah. What advice do you have for for young people trying to enter the Calypso arena mm-hmm. or the Calypso slash arena <laughs> from, from your perspective? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, 
you, you don't understand the foundation of the art form because if you don't have a foundation, if you have no background, you don't know where you're going, you have nowhere to go. Mm-hmm. And and I think the issue for me right now is that we're not really seeing anything in the music. Even though it might be party music, it must have a concept or a theme, it must have something that people can r- connect to and register within yeah. the system that says, hey, watch hey, let's make sense, boy. Chucky, <laughs> watch me. And you say that, right? And you say that because of the conversations, you, yeah, 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 yeah. in studios, mm-hmm. Liming somewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is the conversations you hear from writers, producers, Every, and and performers everywhere? The everywhere. kind of conversations, the level of conversations. Yeah. Sometimes you wonder where are we really going. Yeah, are we yeah. going anywhere? Yeah, Do we yeah. have a vision? Yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man. You know that kind of way. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that's that, no. I mean, we, this is why I can connect with what you're saying. Mm-hmm. Now we go in places, you know. I mean, in your experience as an artist as well, the the ability to to travel and perform has. Doubled and tripled over yeah, the past yeah. ten to fifteen and years, and also widened. And widened, but okay. in in terms of our representation as a unique art form, mm-hmm. I think we need to begin saying something again, and yeah. and that is what the focus is. I mean, it's all well and good that we could produce music for the period and the festival for people to party and to dance to, because I think that's the focus of most artists. Even myself, we try to do that, but also, what what is the balance? What 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 what, what balance are we able to strike to be able to say to people our music has substance and content? Because the one-drop music that reggae has developed and maintained mm-hmm. for 40, 50 years is what have reggae artists successful the world over mm-hmm. for years and years and years and it's the same music because of the, the essence and the consciousness that has allowed reggae to and dance all to bring forward one or two or three or four artists every year i mean look at look at the situation that we have found ourselves in we do have new artists really emerging mm-hmm. in our art mm-hmm. form and it's so difficult for mm-hmm. artists to emerge mm-hmm. you know what i mean mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. because it, it is not we are not connecting with the essence of who we are as a people the soil that our forefathers have laid on this very ground we are not we are not, we are not, we are not holding on connect and was, connection is everything in life you know? i was not going to ask you who is your biggest influence whether soca clips so or outside of that yeah well i i, I particularly um i mean that's a, that's a that's a broad question it's, i know it's a broad question yeah, yeah I, I have many many influences i mean many songs i would hold on to and and listen and feel internally I mean, you, you name it. Even like just up to the other day, I was going through a barren phase where I just appreciating all barren music mm. because of the melodic structure, what he was saying. Um, I mean, well, Sparrow is a is a, is a given. Yeah. Sparrow is a given. given. Is a given. given. Mm. Um, people like Kitchener, Tambu, who but my uncle Sex Sedley Penguin, who wrote my first calypso at the age of eight. You know, he's a guy that some of his calypso is timeless. Mm-hmm. Something like we living in jail. You could take that and ap- apply that to this current experience that we're living in. Yeah. You know, and that's the power of calypso. Calypso tells us everything about every existence and experience in our life. And we need to start to say that again. Yeah. All it's all well and got a party. We could do that. That's fine. Nothing mm-hmm. with us. There's space for everything. And in the same breath, I could say there's space to talk about the politics because I do that as well. Mm-hmm. You know, I, I do my four verses and, and the long chorus and them that, that everybody had to sit down and, and listen and interpret. I do that too. Yeah, but, I, but at the end, <laughs> <laughs> nobody end of the day, where, where's the balance? Yeah, yeah. Tell, know, me about, I, tell me about the first time you went on a stage and you see and you, and you perform and you, you was a, 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 this one, an a, a established artist. Yeah. And you was there for the first time. How was that for you? Well, yeah, yeah it was a nerve wracking experience. But uh, I, I'm going to answer honestly. Only this year, I really start to understand the whole issue of self and confidence mm-hmm. only this year which Seriously? is yeah man of course that's to tell you how how the struggle is real yeah that's to tell you how the struggle is real and then see but you see you know what <laughs> you know what you know what i could believe you mm-hmm. because what was the first thing i said when we yeah. when we started conversations this conversation, conversations what's the first thing i said i said chucky mm-hmm. i honestly see no difference yeah man but I thought it started. Yeah. Because I mean, come on. I can't I can't know everything that you're doing all the time. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. But I actually started to see it now. And and and, and as a but particular... I thought it started last year. Oh well yeah. last season when you actually won. Even 2012 or yeah. 2011 when, mm-hmm. when 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 there's a certain level of consistency that people saw. Yeah. But I need to say this that you may see somebody successful and, and performing at a particular level. Your talent will always come through. That don't mean me experiencing any joy from it. Yeah. You know what I'm, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. A lot of people do things in this life and they do experience the joy. It is through the joy that you're able to share 
and live selflessly. And that is, that is me now because I am no longer bounded by what happens externally. I just do music, which is why my vision right now is to do a video for every song that I'm doing. Yeah. Calypso and otherwise. Yeah. So next to so the album, the focus is now on the work and on the music yeah. and on the essence of yeah. what I'm about. I, I want to be jiggy. I want to whine. I want to sing about girl. I want to sing about bump and whine. Yeah. But in the same breath, I could sing about all the way Strini. Yeah. That's one of the songs that are coming out next, next, ne- next couple of weeks right. with a video as well. Every song has yeah. to be a representation of who I am and what our art form is. I think, I think, I think, I think generally, you know, with with all the music, you know, generally as a person, a lot of us, you know, we get caught up with the past Mm -hmm. and what we want to achieve and we do get to enjoy the moment. We do get to enjoy Ah. now. You no time to think. There's election coming up there now. You see, that's an important you know, point. From yes, boy. Key. A man going to be like, yes. boy, I didn't do this, boy. Yeah, 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 I yeah, didn't yeah. do this. And mm-hmm. So you caught up now with what you ain't do. That's right. Think that done gone. Mm-hmm. And the next breath, you're there like, boy, I want, you know, mm-hmm. see myself down the road. Mm-hmm. Boy, I had to do this. And if I do this now, I ain't going to yeah. get that day. Think wherever, wherever. And you forget to enjoy now. Mm-hmm. Like, what is happening now? Because the mind running. You mind running. And the mind creates suffering if you're not able to think about what you're thinking about. Touch me, my brother. Yeah. Touch me, my brother. Now, <laughs> that's what it now. is. Trust me, no, every time we connect, you know, that's what like, it is. we talk for hours. I'd be like, he deep, you know, he deep. Yeah, yeah that that when we, every time we connect, we talk for hours. But you know what? Um, I saw, well, mm-hmm. again, yeah. following you on the IG, yes, yes, Facebook, yes. Mm-hmm. I realized, well, especially with the European tour and that right. kind of thing, mm-hmm. I realized you're promoting um, uh, Lavantil. What, right. what, what is that about? <laughs> what is that about? Because, I mean, out to the blue, you know, like, all right, most people, when you see them with um, um, t shirts or caps or whatever it is, it's about their song. Yeah, 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 yeah. You understand? Nah, 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 nah. It's about the song or it's yeah. about whatever you're promoting a party. Yeah. But you, mm-hmm. when I saw the love until I say, is that a song Chucky coming nah. with? What is, what, what, what well, is. Well, well, part of the transformation that I am is also understanding where I come from. I live in love until. And yes. Still. Still in love until. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Because yeah. just the other day I called you, I said, Chucky, they house up the road where you are, man. And then take it. I thought that your place, nobody shall tell you my friend place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right, all right. So, Lava Tell is home. My friend place is the brother man. Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. All right. <laughs> anyway, anyway, I'm um, Lava Until, Lava Until. Yes. Lava Until is what they will consider the portal. That's the meaning of Lava Until. Right. That's where the, 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 the name was derived from. Meaning the entry and exit point. Yes. So, as far as historians are concerned, Lavantel created carnival mm-hmm. because the carnival celebration, the ordinance, and there's a little bit of history quickly, 1886 audience. Yeah. The, that's why the Canboulet riots happens every carnival Friday morning around the bridge. Right. That Because that's the origin of carnival, Canboulet carnival, right? Also, Lavantel created the PNM, which brought Trinidad Tobago to independence. Mm-hmm. Lavantel also created the steel pan, steel national pan, yeah. instrument. So Lavantel has contributed significantly to Trinidad and Tobago. But at the same time, Lavantel's neglect has also contributed to the deterioration of Trinidad and Tobago because Lavantel's crime culture has exported to so many areas in Trinidad and Tobago. The Maloney, Zala Hoketa, the Enterprise, all these areas have been infected as a result of Lavantel's neglect discrimination, demonization, poverty, you name it. Mm. And that culture exports everywhere in Trinidad and Tobago. So the, the focus now is fix love until you fix Trinidad and Tobago. And that is the essence of the movement right now. Right. Yeah, it's really, it's really a, a, a initiative from... So big, is it an NGO? Uh, who are you it, working it's with? A, it's, it's an initiative by, by one of John, my big brother John Boy, one of his, his good friends, mm-hmm. who, who's from love until. But beyond beyond the commercial side of it, it really it really triggers something in the core of Lavantillians that has us promoting it because it really means something for people to start to focus on Lavantil and what Lavantil means. And even in discussions with the MP for the area, is a certain understanding that everybody come into. So it it the 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 the, the merchandise is just symbolic, right. but it's also is is important for us to see it. And to feel a part of it, and that is what the whole love until movement is all about. All right, so all right, so we yeah, heard, man. so we yeah. heard the track that you launched in Europe, all right, mm-hmm. for the European tour. Yeah, and let's hear something new. What well, is this yes, track? this one is called No Time, as you mentioned. We live in the moment, you know. Um, a lot of ladies go to the party, you know. I mean, big up my budget in third base, um, Stushini Bush, but it's beyond that, it's, it's about 
the moment right now, if a man come to take a little dance and in a nice and inclusive way, well, looking back and trying to discriminate and think for, don't look back. You have no time to think, no time to blink. Just wine. Just wine. <laughs> Just wine, guys. <laughs> Just wine. <laughs> Just, wine. <laughs> Just fling it back, guys. <laughs> This one is this one is called No Time, produced by Julio. Julio's supposed to be here, but you know, he's on his way listening. Big up Julio every time, right? New Generation Studios. Remember, World Premier. Remember he's now Chuck Gordon. Yeah, man. Chuck Gordon. Hey. Oh, oh. Don't look back. Don't look back. Don't look back. Don't look back. When you are you? Don't look back. Don't look back. Yeah. Baby, I feel in love with no time to think at all. So yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so yeah. What's the reasoning for for the for the name change? It was just a, yeah. Well, it's really to give life to Gordon to uh-huh. be able to 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 swing the Gordon easier. So instead of Chucky Gordon, just Chuck Gordon. And, and it feels nice too. Evolution, you know, the Chucky was younger. Yeah. But, every invention, but I guess. now, yeah. as I chuck them, I keep chucking them. I just pull that and say, Chuck alone and Gordon. To give life to the Roland Gordon legacy. Big of Roland. Yes, I. The man, the energy is always working, you know. Yeah, yeah. Big of Papa Roland and big of Big Brother John Boy. See me, man. So, guys, remember when you all see Chuck. Yeah. yeah. When you all see him, when yeah. you all see. Chucky, mm-hmm. know that he's now Chuck Gordon. But yeah, Chucky yeah. Come wa- but Chucky one side is Chuck. No, it's just Chuck. Chuck Not them. Norris. Chuck them. Just Chuck. Gordon. And, and also Supernova Chuck too. It's coming. Supernova. Why Supernova Chuck now? Why Supernova Chuck? A Supernova is essentially a star when it shines at its brightest. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Supernova Chuck is coming. <laughs> yes, boy. You're just too much of a Superhero chick. guy. <laughs> Supernova Chuck coming into love until normal, normal. Chuck Gordon. <laughs> Chuck Gordon. And actually, it's featuring Fridge. Yeah, man. Uh, he has a video for it already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The video is out on YouTube. So, as as, as is in keeping what I what I said it's true for earlier. Guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah fridge. Yeah, fridge, fridge, fridge. Yeah, um, we're trying to do visuals for for everything that we do because. It's not just about no time, it's uh, about yeah, about time. Because people, when people go to YouTube to hear songs, they like to see yeah, man, yeah, man. Uh, content to go with another you know, a black street with a picture or something yeah. like that. They want yeah, to see yeah. something, so that yeah. actually aids in the songs. Yeah. Push artists, artists investing money. Yeah. Artists investing money. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, after after two um, Kalefso Monarch, I mean, after two Kalefso Monarch, I, I just say, you know, after two Kalefso Monarch, I think... Uh, <laughs> say no more, guy. Yeah, 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 back okay. to back. Back <laughs> to back. Mm, hoping for a third, defending strong. Chuck Gordon. Yeah, man. 961, this is yes, a matter drive. Shal Marshall, Goofy, and Ding Dong, who was basically absent for the interview today. I don't know why. Ding Dong, say something. Say something. You know, um, I don't know. Oh. Ding Dong, say something. Hmm. No, I was more focused on um, listening to the art form and really taking heed from the elders. <laughs> And he, and, and, <laughs> all right, all right. Probably a good thing I was quiet. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't go on. Touch me that again. Touch me that one more, boy. Good thing I was quiet. All right. Ah, gosh. Yes, so, that's, isn't it? as I say, my brother, Chuck, yeah, man. do your thing. Thank you so much. Uh, keep doing the wonderful work. Yes, sir. I love the initiative, the Lab Until initiative. Yeah, man. Um, Hope you achieve you yeah. and whoever else supporting mm-hmm. yeah, well, there's a, there's a team of people like Mr. Really. Ox and the whole team from New York yeah, too yeah yeah a, lo- a lot of people involved and it come and to come hope it's I very mean, successful every day literally people, it's ask, needed. people asking questions about it it's needed yes. it's fix, needed fix love until fiction and Tobago yeah man I, I hear that, that. alright um, so your handles where? yeah yeah well we have the management in the building Michael Mondesi Shane Medford Shane, Shane was in what do you mean Medford? <laughs> Stafford. Oh my God. One, what is your number, Shane? 326 7496. Smart. And we have a whole team that, that work in. And, I mean, it's good vibes, man. Yeah. Pulling together nicely, company, everything. Yeah. Pulling together nicely. Because it focuses on the work and the work. Yeah, Freedom is the goal, you know? Freedom is the goal. And as the elders say, just be at peace. Mm-hmm. Chuck them. Chuck them.